It is a great pleasure for me to welcome you all to the signing ceremony that will launch the EUTF IOM Joint Initiative on Migrant Protection and Reintegration in the Gambia. Today marks the official beginning of the 3.9 million euro three year initiative funded by the European Union's Emergency Trust Fund for Africa and implemented by IOM in close partnership with the Ministry of Interior. The Trust Fund has been created due to the recent unprecedented levels of irregular migration from Africa towards Europe to support the most fragile and affected African countries. Last year, there were an estimated 5,143 dead or missing migrants in the Mediterranean. Far too many, even one would be far too many. We have all heard about the difficulties encountered by African migrants stuck in Libya, with sad stories of kidnapping, slavery, torture, and sexual violence. None of us can remain insensitive to such human sufferings. So today I tell you, ladies and gentlemen, this march towards effective migration governance is on the move. And as we sign this ceremony, it is not only symbolic, it is also a very loud statement about what we are doing practically to stop this human carnage in the deserts and the Mediterranean Sea. The initiative is being implemented in 14 countries, and in the case of Gambia, it has been allocated 3.9 million euros for a total duration of three years. This project, implemented by IOM in close cooperation with the government of the Gambia, has basically three objectives. Support the Gambia to improve the reintegration of returning migrants and to strengthen national structures and capabilities in terms of managing reintegration in a dignified and sustainable manner. Enable migrants and potential migrants to make informed decisions about their migratory journey and to sensitize communities on migration. And last but not least, strengthen migration data and communication on migratory flows, routes and trends, as well as on the needs and vulnerabilities of migrants in the targeted countries in order to support evidence-based policies and programs design. Together we hope to contribute to the building of the new Gambia, where Gambians in the very near future will be opting to migrate via regular means as a matter of choice rather than necessity.